I really like Wacom tablets when they function, but unfortunately, if you're using Windows, you probably come across this problem more than once. Error of the tablet driver was not found. You usually find this when your Wacom tablet either is not working or has no pressure sensitivity. You open the settings and it will say this, and it's... It's quite frustrating. Usually you would have to reboot your computer and it still might not work. So there is an easy way to fix this and that's what I'm going to show you now. So basically what you want to do is you're going to right click the Windows button and click Task Manager. And you are going to make sure that uh, once it loads up that it's not in the fewer details mode. Click at the more details underlying button and then scroll down until you find uh, you might have a lot of stuff until you find these tablet service things. All of these ones that look like the icon for your settings for your Wacom tablet. You're going to want to click End Task on all of these because these are the ones that are misbehaving. So go ahead and click End Task on all of those. And then once that's done, it's actually just pretty simple. That took me about so far like 20 seconds. You're going to type in Services into the, the uh, Start bar. Type Services. And you're going to scroll down until you find all the way at the bottom under W, Wacom Professional Service, this one right here. You're gonna click Start the Service. Immediately after doing that, the Wacom Desktop Center should pop up. And hey, look at that. It opened, no errors. Pressure sensitivity, this is what it's all about, people. Hey, thanks for watching everyone. I hope this video really helped you out. And if it helped you out, you can go ahead and like and go ahead and subscribe. Alright, thanks for watching. I will see you later.